He's in trouble now for starving his three dogs, but we've learned he's actually had dozens of run-ins with animal control over the past decade. So why hadn't he been charged with anything until now? And why did the city hire him? Here's News 13's Alex Tomlin. Dig Jessica, Tim Chavez may be the worst dog owner the city's ever seen. 11 problems with dogs over the last decade, and that's that animal control is aware of. A warning, the video of the dogs is disturbing. These are Tim Chavez's latest victims. Three pit bulls, half their weight, and each with half a dozen different problems. Chavez surrendered the three last week. He was fired from his city job with Family Services the next morning after News 13 exposed the condition of the dogs. Now we've learned he's left a wake of other problem pets in his past. Very, very irresponsible. This individual should not own any animals at all. Animal welfare records dating back to 2002 show Chavez surrendered two dogs that year. Four more the next, all pit bulls. Four of the dogs had to be put down because they were so aggressive. Then in 2008, Chavez adopted Roxy from the city shelter. Animal welfare records show the dog was underfed. He was cited twice and ended up in court. But there he showed the judge his receipt from the vet, and the charges were dismissed. He's playing the system. He's playing the system. Captain Albert Marquez says Chavez knows what to say and when to say it to keep out of trouble. And the system didn't catch it because there wasn't a tracking system to see how many dogs he'd surrendered or how many times animal control had been to his house. That changed a few years ago. So now if it, anybody, that owner surrenders their animal, uh, they can't adopt another animal for a year. In this, this case with this individual, uh, he probably will never be able to uh, adopt another animal. At the time, officers just didn't have enough to charge Chavez. Like with those aggressive pit bulls, animal welfare officers couldn't prove that they had been used to fight. This new pack of dogs shows signs of being groomed to fight. Their ears were cropped. Chavez also had undocumented dogs. Last month, he reported a pit bull was tied up at his gate, left by a stranger. Officials believe it was Chavez's, but couldn't prove it. Shane was so aggressive, they put him down. As for the three dogs that Chavez just surrendered, they are doing better. The city says it'll take months for them to get back to where they were. The city says because of his previous criminal charges were dismissed, they still hired him last year and it didn't make a difference. The mayor's office couldn't say if a conviction would have ruled him out. Jessica? Okay, Alex Chavez is now charged with animal cruelty and torture. The city wants a judge to ban him from owning dogs for life.